Hey guys, so in this video, I am gonna show you what I do to shorten long sleeves and pants while maintaining the cuffs. So I could just fold them over like you see here, but I really like the cuffs. I think they're cute and I really just want the cuffs to show. So I'm gonna show you what I do to shorten long pants and long sleeves on my son's PJs while maintaining the cuffs. So I'm basically going to fold them over. That's it. I'm taking the material just above the cuff and using my fingers to tuck it into the cuffed area until I reach the bottom of the pants. So when you do this, just make sure that the seam is aligned as much as possible when you do it. Um, it may take you a minute to adjust so that it's aligned right. So I did it to one side, I'm gonna do it to both sides, and now moving on to the shirt. So same thing, I'm going to tuck it into the cuff and then align it as much as possible. And this is super easy to do. Um, so I could have done this while my son was wearing the PJs, but he tends to move around a lot and I probably wouldn't have gotten much co cooperation in terms of getting him to stand within the camera frame. So I could have done it, but I'm just doing it without him wearing it for now, for demonstration purposes. So also when I tested it out on him, I noticed that the pants stayed on really well since the cuffs were fairly tight at the bottom, but the shirt would come loose right away. So I ended up having to put safety pins on the shirt to make sure that it stayed in place. So this is the finished product. And so for the safety pins, I basically used two safety pins per sleeve. And when you put the safety pins in, just make sure that you keep the pin in the middle between the outer cuff and the inner material. So I'm basically just weaving the pin through the inner and then the outer material, and the pin stays in the middle that way. Um, and that way it's hidden and you can kind of tuck it in also. So there I am weaving it in weaving it in the other material, and then fastening the safety pin. And then tucking it in. So there you have it. This is the tapered look. This was so easy, it was so fast, and it did not involve any sewing.